Hey everyone, um, just wanted to give you a quick look at three movies that appeared in my mail today. Sorry, my neighbor's air conditioner is on in her backyard and it's just humming away. You can probably hear it. I can see the, uh, the sound bars moving on this thing, so I'll make this brief. Um, one is Dread. I have this on Blu-ray and it's a beautiful transfer and I've also read this transfer on HD DVDs even better than that and the movie itself is spectacular. If you have not seen this movie, I would de definitely recommend it. Much better than the Sylvester Stallone Judge Dredd movie. Um, Carl Urban plays Dredd. It's based on a British comic book, but it is spectacular. The action is some of the best I've ever seen. Um, it's just a, a definitely a movie worth owning. Uh, I would put it up there as far as movies like John Wick that it wasn't something a bunch of people flooded to but after the fact became very popular as people start to realize just how good these films were. This is something you will want in your collection. Uh, and the other two, anyway I'll do a review for all these um, um, sort of later on when I have a chance to watch them I just wanted to show you quickly are Despicable Me and Despicable Me 2. Both movies I also already own on Blu-ray but not only do they include HDR, both of these movies are also Dolby Vision compliant. I think they may be the first two Dolby Vision HDR discs to be released, so I'm really looking forward to seeing that now that I have uh, just this week got a setup, obviously that's all Dolby Vision compliant with the, uh, with the uh, OLED and uh, of course the Oppo and then the uh, and then the, um, the Yamaha receiver. So uh, this is going to be sweet. I love these movies as well, and I think animation looks amazing in anything. You know, whether it was DVD, Blu-ray looks spectacular. So um, and some of the uh, animated HDR films I've seen to this point have been pretty wicked. But these movies have always stood out to me as just being very, very uh, great transfers. So I can't imagine what these are going to look like in. Uh, I can't imagine what these are going to look like in, in, in 4K and with Dolby Vision. Um, anyway, any questions, as usual, please feel free to ask any comments. One of the great things about, I think, my channel is I get some really good people um, that like to talk tech and, you know, feel free to, to talk to others about it in the channel, that kind of thing. That, that doesn't bother me. It's, it's, it's supposed to be a forum where people are comfortable to talk about this stuff. Uh, freely, you know, don't attack other people because they like a certain technology or this or that. We all have our preferences and our choices, and we're all on a different sort of path. You know, we're all, it's not a different path, but we're all on a different sort of point in in the journey along the technology road. Some of us have been at it longer than others, and maybe have bought equipment that, you know, you get people who buy high end. Your people are at the midpoint. People are at the beginning. And the fact is, it's about sort of helping each other and teaching each other. We None of us know everything, as much as some people like to pretend they do. None of us know everything, and we're always learning from each other. So I'll try to help where I can. That's what this whole channel is about. It's not about making money for me. So I don't do 30 videos a day. It's not my employment. It's a hobby. It's for fun. And I want to keep it that way, lighthearted and just talking to some really good people. So anyway, God bless, uh, have a great day, and uh, yeah, I'll talk at you.